All right, we're here at our uh, USJ Southwest Junior Development Camp with uh, Jeff Russell here on my left and uh, Adam Peterson on my right, both uh, national coaches with USTA. Thanks for coming out, guys. Uh, we're doing a little junior development camp this weekend. First off, just tell me, uh, first off, why we host these and uh, kind of what we're hoping to accomplish. Jeff, just maybe start us off with that. Yeah, one of the things that we're trying to accomplish is to try to get a better feel of all the these regional training centers is uh, establish a base of players that we can track uh, through the camps and then uh, plug into our uh, training centers to get uh, elite training. Adam, you, you've already been here in the southwest. You were here last summer. I mean, tell me just how you think maybe some of our juniors are progressing that you've seen. I mean, are they taking to the kind of the curriculum and the advice that you guys are giving? I definitely think so. I was here last summer. So the players are progressing. The ones that I've seen from the last camp have improved in the areas that we recommended to them. So I think that's fantastic. That's what we want to see. Yeah, Jeff, just talk about the kind of what the USDA progression is for these kids. You know, this age, this is obviously a younger uh, group that is camp here this weekend. Um, just talk about kind of what you guys are hoping to get, you know, to spot, and then what, what we're working on. What these kids need to start working on. Yeah, we. we we are focusing a little bit on the younger age. We uh, have a 10 and under component to these camps with the modified formats on the 60 foot court with the orange ball and the uh, 25 inch rackets. And you know, one of our goals and one of the things that Jose and Patrick really are stressing is that we need to have a, a large base of young juniors that have strong and are techni technically and fundamentally sound by the time they're 13 or 14 years old so that we can really focus our attention at the younger age on teaching these kids so that when they become 14 and 15 that we can actually coach them um, and coach them on, on how to compete and how to and how to continue to uh, uh, tactically become more efficient so without the proper technique and the proper footwork um, it's very hard to tactically coach a kid at, at, at an older age. Adam, you know, you've coached some of the one of the best players in the world, Lindsey Davenport. Talk about like what it takes for a kid just even at this age, you know, like, I mean, spotting them at a camp, is it just seeing like their own work habits and their own uh, just skill set already at this age? Is that really what we're trying to uh, kind of instill in some of these kids? I think uh, for most of the kids, having them really be passionate about it and the passion coming from them, not from an outside source, is, is very, very important that they're playing for the right reasons, not to please their mom or dad or, or anyone else other than that the, the game of tennis gives them a, a, a self-satisfaction and joy first and foremost. So they're playing it for the right reasons, which means they're going to be good competitors. All right, guys, thanks for uh, stopping off. I know you guys are doing tons of these camps across the nation, but uh, thanks for uh, stopping off in the Southwest.